guys, this is Puneet Khatri back with another exciting video with iGeeks vlog. Hope everything is going good. So uh, basically guys in this video along with the launch of iOS 9 jailbreak, this video we would be taking a look at the top 10 CDI tweaks that work really great and perfectly fine with iOS 9. So I think you're quite excited for this video, aren't you? So guys, uh, I think let's not waste any bit of time and get right into this video. So let's get started. So guys, to make sure that all those tweaks which I mentioned in this video, you are easily able to install them, I would be uh, mentioning down two repos down in the description. So you please go ahead and just add those repos under Syria so that you don't have any problems in installing those uh, all the tweaks which I mentioned in this video. Alright, so guys, the very first tweak we are talking about in this video is known as BioProtect. Basically, if you're really concerned about privacy, this is a really great tweak for you guys. So guys, what this tweak does is that it does not allow anyone to open any of the application whichever you mention uh, without entering a password or uh, having a touch ID sensor. Or basically, uh, like, uh, let's go ahead and open Instagram. Oh, I need to basically go ahead and scan my finger in order to go ahead and open Instagram or I can basically also go ahead and enter the passcode. So the devices which do not have touch ID can use BioProtector using a password and the devices uh, which have a touch ID like uh, after iPhone 5s can use the touch ID sensor to go ahead and unlock those applications so on the settings we got a couple of options uh, like basically you need to uh, vibrate on uh, error or basically what circular color you need there are basically six combinations available over here and also which applications folder or settings you need uh, to be uh, basically uh, required by a protect in order to open and there are a couple of settings huge this is a really great tweak basically I think uh, you should basically just just try this up this time. So guys now moving up to the next tweak that's uh, the second tweak of this video is known as 4C. So as you know I have my iPhone 5s yes I do not own iPhone 6s I have only iPhone 5s right over here and uh, what did I do on my iPhone 5s is oh guys that's 3D touch right the function that is available only on the iPhone 6s you might be thinking how did I get that on my iPhone 5s so to mention this tweak is known as 4C and this is a freely available tweak from their big boss repo it enables your device running iOS 9 have 3D touch on to your device without ever like because you don't need to spend a huge amount of money to buy the iPhone 6s you can basically have the same 3d touch onto your existing devices so you can see on Instagram over here I have it uh, let's click on camera uh, take selfie record video slow-mo I take photo that's quite exciting so uh, basically if you don't like 4c we have a second option for the same tweak that's known as reveal menu so you can basically also try go ahead and try reveal menu that's really great tweak Third tweak we are talking about in this video is known as shortcuts. So basically shortcut is another tweak that extends your 3D touch compatibility. Basically uh, while the original 3D touch on the iPhone 6s does not have 3D touch on settings. So if I hold on settings you see I get four options that are safe mode, power off, free spring and reboot. That's really great. Uh, under the weather app also I get a 3D touch option because whichever is my native uh, my location according to my location it shows me the temperature for the same. Under city also it gives me an, a 3D touch or option that to add sources. So this is uh, all through shortcuts basically this tweak extend your 3D touch applications and this is really great if you are a fan of 3D touch do go ahead and try it shortcuts moving up next we have a tweak known as alkaline so you can see onto my battery uh, the notification network status over here of a sim card is the you know, we get five dots over here five dots we have right over there and uh, on the battery indicator also I have five dots basically you might be thinking how is that possible this is all through possible via alkaline so under alkaline we get a theme option we get three options basically you can be bolus habits and spots so basically you can change over and just respring your device and it would take effect so guys up next we have a tweak known as virtual home 8 and 9 so basically allow uh, virtual home is a really great tweak that helps you to protect your home button basically you don't need to go ahead and again and again press your home button to mention virtual home 8 and 9 works only with the touch id enabled devices if you have a touch id enabled devices you can basically go ahead and install it what it does is that it helps to save your home button you don't need to press it again and again so you can see I'm on the third page I'll just tap on my home button over here and it takes me to the very first page I'll hold it and it will take me to multitasking I do not press my home button which saves or it increases the, the life of your home button so that it does not get spoiled or stops working or uh, some problem takes place with it up next we have Zeppelin Zeppelin is a tweak that allows you to change the your carrier logo you can see I have a transformer logo over there so if you want to change that how to do that in the settings you get a couple of options 
and also if you don't like these of uh, these all graphics you can basically download or you, uh, from Cydia some other graphics that are available for Zeppelin so these are a couple of some graphics we have uh, like Nike Iron Man Windows 8 Superman Stormtrooper Pac-Man Dark Knight Cloud Beats by Dr. Dre Apple Android or also basically if you don't like this you can have a carrier text if you want to keep your channel names so your iPhone name or whatever you want to have text over here in place of your carrier you can also go ahead with that option this is really great available for free from the big bus repo up next guys we have round dock you can see my dock is rounded over here uh, it's really great right so this is done all through the round dock applicator tweak which is available from free so you can see round dock allows you to curve the edges of your dock so it looks pretty attractive your docks becomes like it's not just the flat dock iOS or the stock iOS version it looks something more attractive like the previous versions iOS uh, basically you can try that on iOS 7 or iOS 6 that looks quite more attractive as like just a, a thin strip or something like that so again this tweak is known as round dock available for free up next guys at number 8 we have this week is known as swipe selection so guys once you type something it's really hard to just press up that and uh, scroll all the way down what swipe selection does it allows you to have your entire keyboard as a selection bar so you can just swipe over here and you can see the selection bar moves up right there so it makes much more easier for you to have the swi so swiping out for selecting uh, so basically if you tap over here you get a prop up and you need to scroll all the way down this problem is solved basically so you can just have scroll scroll all the way from the, your keyboard and it would basically scroll and the entire swipe selection over there there are basically a couple of options under swipe selection in settings you have triple tap over here the whole area you want to keep just the space bar or just some default keys or something like that you can set the sensitivity swipe speed and uh, three finger swipe also you can uh, basically it's really great again this tweak is known as swipe selection do try if you kid up next guys at number nine I have a tweak that is known as local IAP store so what this tweak does is that you don't need to may pay for all the in-app purchases you can basically just go ahead and crack those up so basically this works really great with couple of applications like you can see I have your uh, this uh, you can, uh, this is the hill climb racing application you can see I have over here 17 million coins I can just go ahead and hit on get coins tap over here to buy basically 20 million coins and it would give me a pop-up to enter my Apple ID's password so once you get a pop-up for your Apple ID entering password do not enter password if you enter the password it would charge you from your credit card on your Apple ID just hit cancel and you can see that's it boom we have 20 million coins added to our stock it says directly from 17 million to 37 million that's really great so basically there are a couple of other applications which do support uh, local IAP store like uh, head soccer uh, basically a uh, clash of clans or some online games could not be hacked uh, through this procedure because they work online through their servers so it's quite uh, hard to or it's quite tough to have an in-app purchaser for free on them alright so guys moving up next to the last week of this video is known as barrel so you see when I swipe from pages to pages you noticed uh, that I have some different uh, gestures every time I swipe yes guys every time I swipe I have a random gesture how did I do that I did it through an Apple tweak known as barrel and it is available for free so you can see here we get more you get couple of options a vertex shrink spin radar Swirl, whirlpool basically I prefer random so all the effects are covered in the random whichever effect every time you swipe you get a different effect so basically if you like a particular one or two effects you can set them up and have those effects every time you scroll alright so guys now we come to an end of this video I hope you really enjoy this video I think you did enjoy so if you enjoyed this video please do give a thumbs up to this video because this helps us a lot to create such more great content for you guys and the, this content is obviously enjoyed by you guys so please do hit the subscribe button down right there we have an ocean please do subscribe us for such great content up next and we have really a lot and lots of content to be uploaded and uh, to share with you guys also for latest update you can check our, our blog I would be linking our blog down in the description and that's about it guys and I'll talk to you later in my next video. Peace.